Splendido is a 55 or better life care community in Oro Valley. What that means is anyone fortunate to be older than 55 can choose to retire at Splendido. You have a great active lifestyle today, yet the life care component means that you've pre-planned that down the road, should you need support or care, it's provided at Splendido in an all-inclusive fee. Our mission is to enhance the lives of older adults and to create ways to age well. My goodness, the art programs have truly delivered that. There is a fundamental need in each of us to make that connection and to express ourselves. And our arts programs in every facet is something that enables someone to enhance those connections. The art programs that we've had from a business perspective have elevated the services we provide, it's elevated the resident satisfaction, our occupancies. We discovered so many people were enthralled by the art that we said, how do we build on this? So when we opened Splendido, the next step was to find a community partner. Saka really has become such an excellent community partner. Not only does it provide that connection for us as to ways to integrate ourselves into the community, but also it gives our residents many art festivals and, and events and music events. So it also allows our residents to engage in the community, not just Splendido. At the bottom of that, it's all through art. We have so many artists that call Splendido home, so some of the top art programs are often defined and taught by our residents. The list of creative art programs offered at Splendido, it's, it's a plethora. It truly embraces all facets of art. So from creative writing to creative movement, dance, um, resident improv troops to painting, sculpting, all sorts of, of sketching and arts, photography. The list goes on and on. We had a fairly large home here in Tucson and it required a lot of care. I thought that it would be a good idea to look for something smaller. My wife and I looked at Splendido, came in here, and we've been very happy here ever since. I think one of the attractions to Splendido was their talk about the Michelangelo room. I think the art is important to a community because it, 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 it keeps the people in the community involved, doing something constructive, allowing them to express themselves. One of the ways that Splendido decided to commit to the arts, and one of the reasons was we have an Institute on Aging as a part of our organization. And in their research, they discovered that something as, as simple as looking at art can inspire wonderful emotions, in particular awe, and that can have a direct and immediate impact on your positive feeling about how you feel about your health, how you feel about your day. So Saka has been a bit of a guidepost for us as to how to stay connected to the community. You know, art can have a very important impact on someone's health as we age. I've seen art used as people are working through difficult diagnoses or difficult times in their lives. Art therapy can bring about expre expression of sadness, of fear, of grief. So I've watched in truly some of the most difficult times, art can be used to help heal us all the way through to the end of life. It's possible that someone who can't communicate effectively anymore can still communicate through art, whether that's drawing, painting, or movement. It's just wonderful to see what happens when the music starts to play or the paintbrushes come out. People that have lost so much are still able to, to rediscover those connections.